Welcome to the second video in the five part series on Data Module Manager, one of the most important tools in the Alphari S1000D software suite. In this second video, Rita Nye will start on documentation planning by defining data module codes and importing them into Data Module Manager. Thank you, Tammy. As Tammy has advised, uh, in this session I will be showing you how you can use Data Module Manager to start the implementation of your Data Module codes and importing them into Data Module Manager. So in our previous session we set up our project settings. In this one I'm going to import, so I'll go to Import. And what I'm going to do is follow the wizard through to select that data. So I want to select my data file, which is a CSV file and I specify what type of data module or default doc type I'm going to use. I can go next. What I have here is the list of data fields that are available and the fields that are inside my CSV file. So I can check that each field is marrying up and matching the fields that we've got in our data field. So let's just have a quick look. Okay, originator needs to come down, so we'll move it down. Okay, but as we can see, everything else is matching up now. So we can go next. And it's now looking at all of that content and it can allow you to preview that content. We can go next. And this is going to tell us the confirmation of what's going to happen. So we can look down and check our structure to see if we've got any problems with our import and we can go finish. And our data module codes have now been imported into the data module manager and this completes the presentation of how to import data into your data module manager. When you need to deliver mission critical information, ADG's software, training and professional services will assist you to deliver on time, every time. Aerospace, defence, legal or engineering, your requirements are as unique as your organisation. We are smart content. We are ADG.